project. Now, I briefly mentioned it too. Tokenization, Cosmos is there, is at the forefront of tokenization with Noble, with Mantra, with a lot more that are coming, Corium as well. So it's all coming together. And Noble and Ondo just announced that USDY is now live on Noble. That means more liquidity of native assets in the interchain. And if you're unfamiliar with USDY, USDY is a US Treasury backed stable token where that is also yield bearing. So that asset is now on the interchain. Noble obviously also has primarily USDC. To be precise, $239.5 million of native USDC issued on Noble. And I think a lot of people don't really have Noble on their radar because Noble doesn't have a native token to speculate and to buy. But as of my knowledge, they're still looking into the best way to source security. Right now, Noble is a standalone proof of authority app chain in Cosmos, fully built on Cosmos, fully IBC enabled. And um, they're still considering, like, should they source security from Atom? Are they going to source security from something like Ethos that is bringing restaked eigenlayer ETH into the interchain or something else, right? Or are they just going to build their own chain? I don't know. But considering that these are all real world assets and also Circle is involved in co-developing the chain and those kind of things, I think they probably will use a security provider. Um, maybe even multiple providers, right? Maybe they will use Atom partially to secure their chain while also tapping into Eigenlayer reset ETH through Ethos or eventually also through Atom itself, right? And then there's also Babylon, right? For restaked BTC, basically. So many, many options. And I think they're still considering that. Um, but eventually also, I feel like Noble might just have their own coin. Um, so we'll have to wait and see what's what's cooking there. But keep a close